Hello friends, welcome back to Marquee Soaps. Today we are making Stormwatch. This is a duplication from a Yankee Candle set. And the description is, it is a calm, oh I already forgot it, a calm ocean mist before the storm. Uh, look at the description below, you'll see what the notes are. So we have our, all of our oils added. They are sitting at 84, 83 degrees. And I'm just gonna mix in our additives, which are already in there, and the additives are kaolin clay, coconut milk powder, and sodium lactate. In our oils and butters, we have olive oil, coconut oil, palm oil, castor oil, and sweet almond oil, along with shea butter. So let's get this all incorporated. We'll add in our lye and start making some soap. This bowl is full. I don't think I've ever had this bowl this full before. All right. So, just wanna make sure everything is nice and mixed in. Split off our three accent colors. Our first color is Caribbean Blue by Nurture Soap. Then we have Pep <laughs> we have Preppy Blue by Man Micas and Dark Navy Blue by Nurture Soap. I'm going to mix them out by hand because the supplier for this, the Flaming Candle, did not provide any um, instruction as to how this behaves, whether it rises, whether it accelerates, how it just how it behaves in, in cold process soap. And the reviews only had reviews for people that use it in candles. So it is safe for soap, I just don't know how it behaves. So we are going to just go on the side of precaution and and say it maybe it doesn't behave very well. That dark navy blue, so pretty. So in our big bucket, which is back here, going to scrape down the side where we poured it at well, all the sides actually and we are going to add in titanium dioxide and this has already been dispersed in some warm water Titanium dioxide, you can't really stir in by hand. You have to use a stick blender. So let's get this mixed in. And now we're going to add in our fragrance oil. So here we go. So this is a very light, fresh, clean scent. It is a unisex. It would go for both men and women. So we don't have any ricing. It's not separating. So far, so good. That smells very nice.
we'll just come in with our stick blender with these to make sure all that color is blended. So for this one, I wanna do a drop swirl. And in order to do that, it needs to be just a little bit thicker. So like always, I'm just gonna let this kind of naturally set up by itself for a few minutes before we start to pour anything. I'm gonna put in about half of the white. Now we are going to start swirling. So we have our spoon and I really don't know what I'm going to do, but we're just going to kind of, I think just kind of go like that. Just to give it a little bit of texture, no real rhyme or reason or just so it's not flat on top. I'm going to go around and clean up the edges and then we are done.
Welcome back friends. It's time to get a look at the inside of these bars. The top I just love. So here's our first cut. Those blues are so pretty. I love, I, mean, I think I love all colors in soap. The blues are not something that I normally do, and I really like this one. So we'll get all these chopped up. They will be available on March 7th if you are interested in purchasing them. Thank you for watching, and enjoy the rest of your day, guys, and we'll see you next time.